In this session, I am going to explain about application of P3HT and BVK in optoelectronic devices. First, let us see what are optoelectronic devices. These are the electronic devices that are capable of emitting, detecting or manipulating the light. There are many organic materials used in optoelectronic devices. Some of the examples are polythiophenes or P3HT, which is a light absorbing material. One more example is poly 9 carbazole or PVK, which is a light emitting material. Now, first let us discuss about polythiophenes or P3HT, which is used in optoelectronic devices. It is a semiconducting polymer with high stability. It has a hexyl group which is attached to each thiophene ring and hence enhances the solubility in organic solvents. It acts as a p-type semiconductor as it exhibits conductivity due to holes. Now let us see the properties of P3HT. It has a great capability as light absorbing materials in organic electronic devices. It has a crystalline structure and good charge transport properties required for optoelectronics. It has a direct allowed optical transitions with a fundamental energy gap of 2.14 electro volt. Further, the fundamental band gap of P3HT is 490 nanometer visible region, which is corresponding to pi to pi stars transition, which gives rise to electron hole pair. Moreover, in P3HT, the increase in the conductivity is associated with the increase in the degree of crystallinity. Now, let us see the applications of P3HT. It is used in the fabrication of organic field effect transistors. It is also used as a whole transporting layer in OLEDs to improve their efficiency and stability. It is also used in the construction of organic solar cells. It is also used in the manufacture of smart windows. Further, it is also used in the fabrication of biosensors. These are some of the applications of P3HT. One more organic material which is used in optoelectronic devices is poly N minyl carbazole or PVK. It is one of the highly processable polymers as whole conducting materials. And this is the structure of PVK. Now let us see the properties of PVK. It shows the luminescence. When excited with light or an electric field, it emits light in the blue to violet range. It is highly processable polymer that can be easily spin coated or printed to form thin films. It is soluble in a wide range of solvents which makes it easy to prepare solutions of the polymer for processing. It has a high glass transition temperature and hence it can withstand at high temperatures without degrading. Now let us see some of the applications of PVK. It has been commonly used in OLEDs, light harvesting applications, photorefractive polymer composites and memory devices. These are also used in the fabrication of light emitting diodes and laser printers. It is also used in the fabrication of or organic solar cells when combined with titanium dioxide on glass substrate. Further, it is also used in the fabrication of solar cells when combined with perovskite materials.